Hello students, we are seeing asexual reproduction and in this, the, uh, up till now we have studied about binary fusion, simple binary fusion, transverse binary fusion, uh, longitudinal binary fusion and multiple fusion in amoeba. Like this, we have studied up till now. Now we are going to study budding. Okay, budding in the yeast cell. Okay students. So, we are going to see point wise to remember your answer and get easy to answer. Okay. So, we are going to first start with the yeast cell. How it appears. How it looks. Okay. So, the yeast cell is a unicellular organism. Yeast is a unicellular but most of the species of the yeast are multicellular also. So, first point regarding this is it is unicellular organism. Okay. The second is it belongs to the kingdom fungi. Okay. Kingdom fungi. Okay. Third is approximately the size of the yeast is 3 to 4 micrometer. 3 to 4 micrometer. But it varies from the different different species of the yeast. But approximately <laughs> the size of the yeast is 3 to 4 micrometer. Okay. It reproduces all sexually. That is all symmetrically. The divisions are Asymmetrical means what? They are not in a symmetry like binary fusion. They are asymmetrically. Now, now this the parent cell is bigger. This bud is very small in size. So it is asymmetry. Okay. So it is asymmetrically divided. Okay. The divisions are asymmetrical okay then what happens here now we will shift here this is a cell it has a nucleus okay and this nucleus here you can see a protuberance okay it is known as protuberance it is known as protuberance which occurs in over the yeast cell when the nucleus expands little bit here. Okay. Uh, it, this is a parent cell and here the protuberance occurs. Okay. It is in the full size. Okay. Full size it develops here. This protuberance. Afterwards what happens? The nucleus splits here. This is a parent nucleus and this is a daughter nucleus okay and here this is a new bud formed here okay this is a parent cell this is a parent nucleus this is a daughter nucleus and this is a new bud which were, which was developing in this stage but here it has developed okay so here you can see the splitting of nucleus hmm? splitting of Nucleus. Hmm. Afterwards, what happens here? You can see the cell is also, this cell is little bit pinched here and it is separated. And here you can see the chains of buds formed here. This is a parent cell and these are the daughter cells. Okay. So you can see here the Daughter cells are very smaller than the parent cell. Okay. So here what happens? Cell splits. Okay. Here the cell splits and <coughs> separates daughter cells are separated. Okay. Daughter cells are separated here. <coughs> And you can see the chain of 
birds form in the last stage of this uh, yeast cell production. Okay, so this was the yeast cell uh, budding and there are also many plants which have budding that is potatoes and uh, you can say ginger. These are also the plant species which have uh, the reproduction or sexually by budding. Okay, so this was the uh, multi, <coughs> this was the budding which in the yeast cell. Okay, students, if you have any doubt in this, you can ask me or you can comment me. Okay, thank you students. Thank you for watching.